It's all about building a website and the essential things that you'll need. You will not need a web developer to build you a customized website. There are plenty of platforms now that have built-in SEO, search engine optimization. They're responsive to all different types of devices like mobile phones and tablets and laptops. And they also have some really great themes for people in the fitness industry um, so that you don't have to create anything from scratch. What you need to do is choose one of the four best website platforms out there, which are very, very inexpensive. There's WordPress, there's Shopify, Wix, Square, like super easy to upload your content, your video, your photos, and your uh, written content, and you can get them up and running in a matter of weeks. Now you might need a web developer if you want to have some special coding that you want um, done, you want something special to your website, but certainly not to build a customized site. Now, there are also some essential um, items that I think are really important to anybody who's starting a website that's helping people lose weight, um, exercise at home, launching some kind of a course or live streaming um, video. Definitely want to include your testimonials on your homepage. Um, and if you have video, I would definitely display video um, in an introduction to yourself, an about section, a start here, a welcome section on your website. If you are helping people lose weight, you definitely want to have a weight loss calculator and a meal planner on your website somewhere, which will keep them coming back to your website and use it as a home base for their fitness journey and their weight loss journey. There are some great plugins to have visitors refer friends to your website. They just put in their first name, last name, email, and then forward their, that your website to their friends by doing the same. So a refer a friend capture, definitely on your homepage site. You definitely want to put your press coverage on your homepage and also a place for community to gather, to have conversations, a forum. In your about section, you definitely want to include some amazing photos of yourself along with um, a really great bio. And if, that, if you've been interviewed for anything, um, you want to link your uh, bio to those media outlets as well. There are some website themes that have sliding carousels that you know you can time to move every three seconds, five seconds, and I think this is where you want to feature on the home page any fundraisers that you're working on or special events, runs, or, or you know super great class. If you are taking appointments for one-on-one -on -one personal training classes or you have a class um, that you're offering, then you definitely want to have an appointment calendar and you want to have your scheduler um, on your website. And there's some great plugins from where WordPress to do that. The next thing you want to have is an email capture and that will enable you to get anybody's email who's visited the website, uh, might be interested so that you can follow after them and send them, have an automated email or send them a personal email um, to, you know, get them on board. So a couple of trends that I've seen in website themes that are really great but can run you have, have you running into some trouble. One of them is the hero image, that big full bleed um, image that goes from you know, every, every part of the website. The problem is if you don't shoot photography like that and it isn't fabulous, it's not going to look that great when you blow it up and put it on your home site. The second one is the scrolling parallax, which I think drives me nuts because the website never seems to end. I would stay away from themes like that. So you're going to be hosting with another um, hosting site. It could be GoDaddy, Bluehost, Dreamhost, um, but you want to be able to link that name that you've bought with your WordPress, Shopify, or whatever uh, platform you use. And that's a pretty easy link to do.